a quick video and I want to talk to you about my favorite W218H from Casio and um, this is my current collection so this is the way it started with this one this one came along second and um, this one third and lastly but definitely not least came the camo version now um, I'd seen this model online uh, on a Facebook group and I had to track one down. So uh, it's the W218H and then there's obviously some other digits that go on the end which I'll put up on the screen in a moment and that'll give you the precise model number to try and track down the, the camo version. They're quite hard to find. Uh, quite often you'll, you will find a listing for them but you'll find they're out of stock. So um, uh, if you do see one, grab it. Um, I managed to pick this up for under £20 um, from a seller in the US and I'm really pleased with it. I think it looks like it looks like a really nice watch. Uh, however, it doesn't come with this green strap. It comes with a black strap, much like these other models. Now, I've previously done another video where I tried to find a green strap to match this one and I, um, I tried a few sort of fabric ones and I even tried a a watch from Skimmy, which um, I thought on the pictures online would give me a, a good color match, but it didn't. And um, I've gone back to just the black strap with this. However, to mod this one, I thought I'd actually track down the, the Skimmy W218H model equivalent, which is the um, 1496, I think it's called. Yeah, so the Skimmy 1496. So I thought I'd track one of these down, and these actually come with a green strap. So, it doesn't take a genius to work out what I did here. I swapped the straps over. Um, so I paid about eight pounds for this one, maybe nine. I paid 20 pounds for this. So in total, you've got about 30 quid here. And um, that has resulted in me with the skimmy watch in black and the Casio W218H with this very well matched camo strap if you ask me I think this looks really nice I'm actually gonna see if I can find a brown one as well I think uh, a brown strap might look quite good on here uh, if you know where you can get a brown strap identical to these 218H straps then um, then let me know um, if you've seen any other my videos you know I'm not a fan of NATO's I don't like the way that the NATO strap just sits in between the lugs and then you have this um, sort of um, tapered bit on the outside so I'm very keen to find ones that uh, that that fit a little bit more um, in line with the actual um, bezel if you like so um, yeah the only other thing that I did other than change the strap was I swapped over the buckle so the skimmy watch come with a silver buckle but I swapped that over to uh, to the black plastic one because I think that just keeps the the whole aesthetic of this watch looking uh, looking pretty cool. So so yeah, so there we go. It's a W218H mashed up with a uh, Skimmy 1496 to give me this model, and um, I really like it. If you like this watch, let me know below. If you don't, also let me know below. Um, and um, if you've seen a brown strap, or maybe I could get some brown adapters and a dreaded NATO underneath. Who knows? We'll see. Maybe another video. If you want to see that in another video, then um, put a comment below, and I'll um, and I'll do that. I'll see if I can find some adapters and put this on a brown strap and see what that looks like. Anyway, for now, leave a comment, give us a like, thumbs up, subscribe, all those YouTube goodies, and I'll see you in another video really soon.